Good evening, dear children. So today we are going to discuss exercise 1.1, question number 6. Okay. What does question number 6 says? Himadri has a collection of 625 Indian postal stamps and 325 international postal stamps. She wants to display them in identical groups of Indian and international stamps with no stamp left out. What is the greatest number of groups Himadri can display the stamps okay so we will see so whenever we're talking about maximum number the greatest number is nothing but acf of those numbers okay so now we will find it out the solution the greatest number of groups himadri can display the stamp is acf of 625 and 325 okay by euclid algorithm we are just finding the acf 625 325 into 1 plus 300. 300 is the remainder. Then again, this divisor will become dividend now. 325 equal to 300 into 1 plus 25. Then 300 will come here. 300 equal to 25 into 12 plus 0. Therefore, the greatest number or the HCF of 625 and 325 is 25. This is the required solution for question number six i hope everyone is clear simple question only the acf you need to find the second one question number seven two ropes of land 64 centimeter and 8 cent 80 centimeter both are to be cut into pieces of equal length what should be the maximum length of the pieces again concentrate on the word maximum the maximum length is nothing but the acf of 80 and 64 okay so basically here we are talking about question number seven. The maximum length of the pieces is the ACF of 80 and 64. So since we are talking about Euclid algorithm here, so we will use it to find the ACF of 80 and 64. 80 equal to 64 into 1 plus 16 is the remainder. Then 64 will become as dividend. 64 equal to 16 into 4 plus 0. Since remainder is 0, we'll stop it here. ACF of 80 and 64 is 16. Therefore, the maximum length is 16 centimeter. Very easy concept that we have. Okay. Next. Next, we will move to exercise 1.2. We'll move to exercise 1.2. What does exercise 1.2 says? This is a very easy concept, okay? Express each number as a product of its prime factors. We need to find the product of its prime factors. Let's just do it, okay? Just go through it. Exercise 1.2. Okay? This is question number one, Roman number one. That is 140. Now, 140. Everyone knows it, okay? 140, I will find the effect 270, 235, this is 5, 7. So I can write it as 2 square into 5 into 7. This is the product of the prime factors. Clear everyone? Simple concept. Roman number 2, 156. Same thing, 156, 2, 7 to 14, 8 sir, 16, 2, 3 sir, 6, 2, 2, 3 sir, 6, then we have 6, 3 sir, 18, 2, 18, 2, 9, 3, 3. Okay. One fifty six. So therefore, one fifty six is uh, three. It's correct. Two nine. It is two to the power one two three four into three square. Okay. This is what one fifty six is. Now, question number two. What does question number two says? 
Find the LCM and HCF of the following pair of integers and verify that LCM into HCF equal to product of two numbers. Okay, we need to find that HCF and LCM and also we need to find the product of two numbers. Okay, 26 and 91. 26 equal to this is 2 into 13 91 if I take 91 this is I think 7 1 3 7 into 13 therefore ACF equal to common 13 LCM equal to 2 into 7 into 13 is 182. Clear? We got HCF into LCM. Now, HCF into LCM. 13 into 182. 13 into 182. How much are we supposed to get? 13 into 182. That is 2366. Clear? Product of two numbers. What are two numbers? Product of equal to 26 into 91 this is 2 3 double 6 hence ACF into LCM equal to product of two numbers okay hence it is verified very simple concept that we have in question number two now, question number three. Question number three, find the LCM and HCF of the following integer by applying prime factorization. This is Roman number 1, 12, 15 and 21. Okay, 12 is nothing but how much? 2 into 2 into 3. 15 is 3 into 5. I'm just directly doing, okay, this is an easy one. 21 equal to 3 into 7. HCF equal to common factors 3 LCM equal to 2 into 2 into 3 into 5 into 7 this is nothing but 420 clear this is question number 3 Roman number 1 easy concept next question number 4 given that ACF of 306 comma 657 equal to 9 find LCM of 306.657 we need to find the LCM okay this is what it's mentioned we know just now we have done one formula we have is LCM into LCM equal to product of two numbers ACF into LCM equal to product of two number that is 9 into LCM equal to 306 into 657 LCM equal to 306 into 657 divided by 9 okay 3 I am cutting 3 3 I am cutting 1 0 2 Okay, again I'm cutting 3, 3 is a 9, 3 4 is a 12. LCM equal to 3, 34 into 657 equal to 34. 7 for the 28, 2 remainder, 5 for the 20, 2, 2. 6 for the 24, 26. 1, 5 is a 15, 17, 18. 21338. That's what the answer we got. 21338. I will just cross that answer and we will see what. Six is a uh, one second. 21, 5 times 15, 16, 17, 18, this should be 19. Okay, this should be 19. 2, 2, 2, 2, 3, 3, 8. 
clear simple concept that you have so i would request you all to please complete till question number four today of exercise 1.2 i will provide you the solution in google classroom please complete it okay. any doubt please let me know thank you have a nice day